I was just trying that. I feel like that's gotta be better, right? Hey, how's it going? Uh, hi, hey, how, what's up? I'm dead for ideas. See, I have this notebook written on September 15th, 19, 1918. Uh, I'm just gonna go through here and do really quick hot takes and maybe some of them will at some point be made a full video, but I don't think so because a lot of these are kind of stupid. 20XDX proves we need more roguelike crossovers. Uh, 20XDX is the roguelike that is built like Mega Man X. It's awesome, you should go play it. Yeah, because I would totally play Castlevania version of a roguelike. The second one just says, Fuck it, Spelunky. You win. I've played Spelunky uh, about 7,000 times, and I have beaten it zero times. Why aren't JRPGs cute anymore? Why did I write this down? I haven't played a JRPG in uh, about 100 years. How would I know that? I... What I love about slash hate about Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy, one of my favorite series of all time. However, there's really only four games that I would replay. A six, seven, nine, that's three. Four? <laughs> that's, that was confusing. Uh, Final Fantasy four, and that would be the fourth one. Elon Musk can eat a butt. I was trying to find an alternative to eat a dick. This is not it. It's not any better. Stop being in the limelight. I don't care that you smoked weed online. Who gives a poop? Video games are about more than escapism. Truth. Games are more complicated and diverse. Popular AAA video games can f*** right off. I can't remember the last time I got excited about a AAA game. And that's not because they're bad games or they're poorly done. It's just, they're just the same thing. Is it really going to be that different from GTA V? I don't think that it is. How could you make a good Game of Thrones game? They already did it. Realms, Game of Thrones. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's a good video too. No one's even trying to mess with their controllers. Not true, Jake. Microsoft just released, um, what do they call it? An excessive, let's, I'm gonna look it up. Xbox Adaptive Controller. It's cool that they made that effort to make a controller that is more accessible. Uh, if they were successful or not, I don't know, but somebody's starting the ball rolling. That's good. Should Google make a console? Um, no. No. That they were talking about making a console. Um, no. Why? It's just, why? No. That's okay. Uh, let's not worry so much about current genres because they suck anyway. Oh, this was a callback to a, a talk I saw with, I think, Jonathan Blow. The genres in movies describe like how you're expecting to feel, and the genres that video games have are just talking about the mechanics, usually. Point and click, first person shooter. And I'm not saying that games need to be parallel with movies, but we should find something better. Oregon Trail is probably not as good as you remember. I don't know, probably. What the hell was I gonna write about that? What you can do with Dwarf Fortress. Make stuff. How this could be a good video is if I found a bunch of people who played Dwarf Fortress and I went and interviewed them, the stuff that they built in there. Asymmetrical multiplayer games are untapped and really fucking exciting. And then it says, be more specific. I don't have to be. But I had this discussion with somebody recently. Asymmetrical multiplayer video games are cool. I listed off some of them and I was like, these haven't done all that well. <laughs> Friday the 13th, Evolve, Spy Party. I forgot about Spy Party and I should have brought that one up. The two players are participating in two completely separate games against each other, which is really interesting. That's it. How do I end this thing now? Usually end it with a joke or a quip or something silly. Here's the joke we ended on. My camera got sick of hearing me talk, so it just shut itself off. Fair enough.